After our first unbox impressions of the ZU80 COB video lights, we finally got to use and test them in a proper video shoot. Just as we set up our shots, we immediately noticed that the color temperatures are off. Way off the charts. After the video shoot, we decided to do a quick test and here are the results. 2800K on the ZU80 is actually 2660K as per our Seconic color meters reading. 3200K on the ZU80 is 2780K on the Seconic. 4500K reads 3400K on our color meter. And 5600K is actually 4030K. These readouts are consistent across the light output of the ZU80 light. They yield similar color temperatures on the Seconic at 10%, 25%, 50% and even at 100%. The LCD readout on the ZU80 video light is simply not accurate. This is not a big issue for us as we are experienced enough to know how to compensate and correct our lighting to our camera's color temperatures. It is important to take note of this color shift and inaccuracy so that we know how to dial in the correct settings. These cheap or budget China COB video lights are definitely not industry standard, but that doesn't mean that they aren't usable. One major disappointment for us is its inability to at least hit a proper 5600K for daylight balance in outdoor conditions. For us, we think that they are better warmer than cold, and luckily, there isn't a very obvious green cast like in the earlier generations of LED panels for video lighting.